Frankfurt Airport destination, London, England. We're going on a sailing trip. So let's go inside the terminal first and then I'll show you how to board and how we get to Heathrow Airport from Frankfurt Airport. So I'll see you guys. If you're interested, keep watching. Okay, so we're at Terminal 2. Okay, now we have to see where British Airways leaves from. So let's check this little, uh, this little chart. British Airways here. And it leaves from E, actually, yeah. D and E is that way to the right. So we have to go this way. This is Frankfurt Airport, everybody. Terminal 2. Okay, so we're going here. We just have to leave our luggage here. So here. So this is the bag drop for passengers who have already checked in online. So we have our boarding pass. We just have to leave our luggage here. So on this occasion, we're going sailing and we have a lot of luggage. We have these big bags. I'm gonna talk about them in uh, the video that I'm gonna do about sailing and what you need, what type of sailing gear you need and all that. So this is my bag this time. It's really heavy, big. Thank goodness it has wheels. So you just show your boarding pass and leave your luggage there and, and that's it. That's all you have to do here. No big deal, and the line is really short. Our turn. To show your papers and identification. These are big bags. 17 kilograms. That one is 17 kilograms. Let's see how much mine is. Okay, mine is a little lighter, 14.7 kilograms. Oh, I just lost some weight. <laughs> so we had a little tiny problem. Um, the boarding pass that we had said that we had checked in from um, from Frankfurt to London, but they said it wasn't in their system, that they only had London to Frankfurt. So we had to uh, check in again, but we were on the same line. It took just five extra minutes, that it, that's it. Uh, but Okay, this is the boarding pass. We have to go to D6. D6 would be to the left, so let's go this way. Oh, okay. Here. Okay, got it. <laughs> now we have to go through passport control. Okay, this is what you have to do. You have to present your passport on this scan, and then they scan your face. When you wait on the other line, look to the camera. Okay, thank you. Okay, no problem. They said to just pass. I had to scan. It's very fancy now. You, there are no people involved. You just scan your passport, and and that's all you have to do. And then you, the door opens. You pass, and they took a picture of you. And we're at duty free. One of my favorite places. So yeah, I'm gonna take a quick look. You know, I usually don't buy anything unless it's like a travel kit or something special or special price. Cause I, I rarely find bargains and it's not worth carrying everything, you know? I might as well just buy it in this, where I live. <laughs> so I'll show you around a little bit. Nice. See, I like these little kits, but you know, it's all broken. <laughs> But I like like travel kits and little like 
the small sizes of everything, that's what you find a duty free, you know? Like a a travel kit of brushes, makeup brushes. <laughs> Alright, so let's see the status of our flight. We're leaving from D6, so we're in the right place. We are leaving at 10.55, flight is BA903, and it's going to London Heathrow, and we are leaving from Area D. If this looks confusing, check out my video on adapters and transformers and chargers and all that. I'll leave the link below and above. So these are the services they have. And they have showers, which I think is really cool. You know, if you have a long flight, you feel disgusting and you want to take a shower, just go in there. It's really, it's cool. All right, so let's make sure our gate hasn't changed because sometimes they do that. You have to be careful with that. So here, 1055 BA 903 London Heathrow Terminal 2. We're in Terminal 2 and gate D6. D6 is straight ahead. Which reminds me, we haven't gone through security, and that's here. That's where we have to go. So you guys know the deal. So our gate is right here, who's right across from security. Security was fine, and it was right here. No problems with security. We're boarding. Not priority, normal. Hello. Oops. Hello. Hola. Hola. Thank you. I'm going this way. <laughs> Take the lazy way out. Oops, almost fell there. Okay, just a little tip. Always have your passport and your boarding pass handy. Like in a front pocket or something. Uh, uh, somewhere that will be easy for you to find. Okay, so it's always handy and you won't have to like delay the line and have to look all over your back.
Brendan. People are in a hurry. Okay, so we have to get our luggage at baggage reclaim. Just follow the signs. UK border. Oh. I guess we have to go to immigration. So we have to go through here. A lot of people. You could pass through immigration through the E if you have an E passport. You could go that way and the line is shorter. We could have done that, but we didn't see it. To the right and down. Okay, now we have to see where we have to go. Where do we reclaim our bags? Uh, we are coming from, where is it? Frankfurt, okay, we're coming from Frankfurt and we have to go to 11. See it? We're coming from Frankfurt, so we have to go to 11. Let's go. Baggage belt seven to 11, this way. Wow, it's the last one. Interesting, here you can get SIM cards and cash. Okay, there's 11. Let's see if our bags are there. Look at that. My goodness. Okay, here they are. Let's go, let's go get the bus. Exit that way. Okay, hoppers, so we're at Heathrow Airport. Fine, we got here, no problems. Uh, for those of you who just wanted to see this, you can go on to my next video because now we're going to take a bus that will go to Southampton. So if you guys are interested in that, keep watching. And then we're gonna end up in Hamble and then you'll see. So this is Terminal 5 in uh, Heathrow Airport. Uh, I don't know what airport I'm in. Heathrow Airport Terminal 5, International Arrivals. Got that? <laughs> okay, so we're here and we're going down here by bus. So we're taking National Express and they have an office here at Heathrow Airport. Okay, so now I have to take a bus, so I have to look for where my bus leaves from. Just follow the signs, we have to go outside says bus stops there we have to see where ours is so here it says national destinations coaches we're taking national express so it's gates 11 to 15 so let's go that way so you have to see where your bus leaves from this one goes to Birmingham, Birmingham goes to uh, Bradford, Bristol, Cambridge, etc. I have to look for, in London, I have to look for the one that goes to Southampton, what? which is right there. 203 goes to Southampton. So we're going to take bus 203 that goes through Southampton. I made a reservation for this bus online, so I have to go at the time that I booked it for. Ugh, can't get the words out. Here's the schedule. Heathrow Airport Terminal 5 Arrivals Level. And you see there are quite a few buses per day. There are 15. So you won't have any problem finding a bus to Southampton or Portsmouth. Portsmouth, right? <laughs> Here it is. So, via Winchester. Southampton and Portsmouth. South Sea 203. Okay, so we're in Southampton. Now we have to take a taxi to the hotel we're going to that is on the coast in a little town called Hamburg. Okay, so we're here. 
uh, for those of you who joined me to the very end thank you very much and I'll see you guys in my next video thanks for watching I'll be filming a little bit on the sailing part of this trip because it is a sailing trip and I don't know I don't know if I'm gonna vlog it or if I'll just do like a few videos we'll see okay so I will be having something for you guys though all right, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you guys want to see more videos. And now I'm going to go to the local pub and have me a beer and some fish and chips or something like that. Very typical, traditional English food. <laughs> so, see you guys. Bye.